Hi, you are watching Christian Vibes TV, your favorite gospel entertainment blog house in Ghana, West Africa, and the whole world at large. If you like our videos, please do subscribe by clicking the subscribe button down below and turn on the bell to receive post notifications and alerts. Hello, Christian Viber. Welcome to your favorite gospel entertainment blog house, your number one stop channel for all your gospel content in Ghana, West Africa, and the whole world at large. Christian Vibes TV. If this is your first time doing the watching on this channel, kindly subscribe by clicking the subscribe button down below and turn on the bell beside it to receive post notifications and alerts whenever we post a new video on this channel. This has been um, your go to channel for all your gospel content in Ghana, West Africa. Your celebrity, your pastor, your, your best friend, your favorite person is watching christian vibes tv and i believe you also are doing the watching wherever you are also today um one very interesting video popped up on the internet and i saw it and i felt the need to come and share it with you with our community we have on youtube about the esteemed reverend eastwood anaba and the mysterious things that the lord is doing through him and through his ministry and through the messages and then the the reactions and the motivational um, good things that he drops in and out of the of the the spirit of God every now and then. Today I saw a video on the internet about the Reverend Eastwood Anaba and he was singing um, gospel musician Nasi's uh, how do you call it song Asida and something caught my spirit about the way that the esteemed Reverend went about. The, the the reaction with Nasi song he spoke about how King David would have reacted when he was in the same mood playing the harp for the spirits or demons to leave the the hearts of King Saul and it, it drew my attention to the quality of musicians that we have in our country Ghana and also some of the things that we should uphold and rejoice that we we have in the ministry we have in the body of Christ um I don't think you have seen the video, but then we'll go and check out the video shortly. He also made certain revelations which caught my attention. And you know, the Reverend Eastwood Anaba has been one of the faith um, upholders in our country. He's a papa for everybody. He's somebody who has put himself out there to see that all young ministers and people who are committed to knowing the Lord um, read his story hear his story and he keeps saying it all the time he made mention of um how he lost his family tragically and how um on his birthday nasis i said that song reminded him of the incident and he made them sing the song in his presence let's go check out the video when i come back we'll talk about the rest dearly apostolic father of our nation a happy 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 birthday Hallelujah. amen I was just sitting there and then all of a sudden I saw that Nasi just you know I just heard Nasi's voice and I'm like ah, where is he coming from then I saw he came and then he was singing Asida and you know Asida is a song I like because the lyrics they very much agree with you know some of them now so you know um, we just oh we are not ready for it if we are not ready for it we can kill it Okay. If we are not ready, we can we can we can leave it. Probably they are not they are not in the mood for it. Especially today when I heard the uh, see today I said it's just the beginning of the song I like that thing the ping 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 yes. so allow them to play only that part small and then when I release you then you can sing back listen if you don't like if you don't like this tune if you are Saul's demon and David was playing the demon would never leave you I'm sure this is what David played. Where you may 
Check out the video when I come back. We'll talk about the rest. For some years now, for some years now, I don't do birthday celebration. I do birthday deliberation. Deliberation. So, normally, I choose to be on the side of the people who on their date of birth, they are not very happy. There, there are some people like that. When, when is their date of birth, they are not very happy. And it's not a crime. Okay. So normally I don't do party, I don't celebrate, I don't dance, I don't play music. I play music, but it's Christian music, okay? And then it's not the kind of music you dance by the way, the way, the way like that. As if there's no wahala in the world. Because you know, years ago I went through some crisis in my family, and the thing left a very deep dent in my life. And I don't want to pretend it doesn't exist, because Many times people forget where you are coming from. Uh, especially if you cover the whole thing up with too many parties and too many dancing and singing and eating and feasting all over the place. So I chose to do celebration. Instead of celebration, I decided to do deliberation. Okay. So, but maybe one day when I'm about 70, 75, thereabout, I may do some celebration. But for now, 
for now, I just want to do the deliberation. So yesterday, I had a prayer meeting in the morning by Zoom. Then I went to a friend's office and did a prayer meeting again. And then in the afternoon, we went to a friend's house to go and eat. I don't think Reverend Eastwood Anaba is in this boat alone about um, making celebrations and uh, deliberations on birthdays. Myself, for some time now, I'm very young. The Reverend is, is much older than me. But then I've come to a point where on, on birthdays, I don't really celebrate. I deliberate. And so just as the, the, the Reverend Eastwood Anaba mentioned that he does, um, I also spend time in prayer and also um, listening to spiritual and gospel music on my birthday. And yeah. Uh, rejuvenate my spirit and also look at the things that the Lord has done for me and what I look at doing for the Lord and the Lord doing through me through submission in the coming year. Um, that days are a time for proper um, learning and I believe that every Christian at a point in time you have to come to realize that um, these days are days that set a mark that helps you to grow at some point in time. I love the uh, Reverend Eastwood Anaba for this fact that he shared the things that he does on his birthday and the things that um, God has brought him to light to understand. You know, um, it is quite interesting to learn these things from an esteemed man of God such as um, Reverend Eastwood Anaba. Let's go check out some of the videos. Let's go check out some of the um, performances, the songs that he sang that really moved people's hearts. Hi, you are watching Christian Vibes TV, your favorite gospel entertainment blog house in Ghana, West Africa, and the whole world at large. If you like our videos, please do subscribe by clicking the subscribe button down below and turn on the bell to receive post notifications and alerts.